So the PS5 just released its uh, controller and um, I'm going to get my thoughts on it and um, I guess I'm going to go over some of the futures. Yeah. What up, what up, what up? It's your boy. You know, it's uh, the Kickback Kid. Absolutely. Live here and live in the flesh. You already know what it is. and You already know what to do. Skiggity scat, skiggity scoo. Yo, um, we got the controller, uh, PS5 controller. Um, I'm, this, is, this is just a small brief little vid and whatnot and what have you. Um... You know, I'm just going to go over a bit of the futures and then I'm going to just, uh, you know, just get my thoughts about it and let you know what I think about it and whatnot and what have you. Uh, now, um, the way I see it, eh, let's go over some of the features first. OK, supposedly I'm going to start with this. This ain't really too exciting, but I mean, whatever. Um, longer battery life. Um, apparent, apparently it's supposed to have longer battery life. Uh, we'll see. You know, um, I hope so. You know, uh, that's. I guess that's that's cool to know, but we'll we'll see if it's actually, you know, true, you know, once the PS5 is released and comes out and all that other good stuff. Um, next. Um, dang it. What else? There was something else. Oh, um, they changed the name. <laughs> um, DualSense. It's no longer the DualShock anymore. DualShock out. Uh, DualSense in. So DualSense. Um, OK. And I, and I guess they call it that because of the new rumble uh i guess technology that they put in the controller uh it's basically kind of like i guess the same tech that the xbox one has which is just basically very sensitive uh rumble you know in the controller like yo trust me. I, I, everyone knows that i love my xbox controllers um uh, if if the ps5 can even just match up if the ps5 controller can just even match up the rumble that i think the xbox one controller has that'd be lit you know what I mean? Because I, I love the rumble in this one, you know, playing fours or playing gears, you know, feeling that little bit of rumble at the tip of the trigger and at the tip of the bumper. That that mess is lit. I remember when the Xbox one first launched and I remember, you know, feeling that 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 type of rumble tech. It, it, it was impressive back then and it still impresses me today. I will. I wouldn't say it impresses me today, but I still like it. You know what I'm saying? It's lit AF. Um, but, you know, I guess so, you know, Sony's going to have that, you know, same type of rumble, rumification. <laughs> I just made up a word. You know, um, I, I would like to think that it will be better, at least in the Xbox One, since, you know, it's a newer console and everything. I'm hoping that it's better, you know, or at least just as good as the Xbox One rumble, but hopefully better. I mean, come on, Sony, it's, it's a new console. Let's 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 push it. Let's let's do the damn thing. You know, so um, that's that's one thing. I'm actually kind of eh, mildly excited about that. I'm, I'm hoping that they do a hell of a job with it, but I don't I, I don't think that their rumble in particular is going to be better than uh, the X series uh, rumble um, only because they already kind of had this tech and they already done it in the Xbox one and they're probably just going to do it better. But who knows? I could be wrong. Whatevs. Another thing, um, the controller has a built in mic. Uh, OK, I like it. I think it's cool. Um, do I think it's like the best thing thing since freaking i don't know me no but um <laughs> it's uh <laughs> it's it's cool um you know it's i like it okay it's 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 a good thing it's a plus um uh, for people who you know may not you know you know they might have their headphones broke because of their last rage from playing Fortnite or something like that or whatever it is that they play you know or if they lost the you know their their heads headset or you know maybe they just don't have a headset at the moment you know um, it's 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 convenient. It makes convenience, and I guess it'll come in handy. It's a plus. I like it. I think that's cool. Um, another thing, um, that I noticed that the uh, the handles are more curved. Now that I personally like, I think it's gonna be a comfortable controller. I got big hands. I can just about palm a basketball. I can palm a basketball. So I kind of like my controllers fairly big. So assuming that the controller, I heard it's a little small, but uh, you know, hopefully it's about at least the size of an xbox one controller maybe a little bit bigger i would love that that'd be nice you know but i understand you know it's got to be a universal controller everybody's got to be able to you know skig and screw with it or you know in other words everyone has to be able to you know handle that thing handle that monster you know what i mean and, and you know feel comfortable uh gaming with it you know uh but i mean show some love to the big guys man because i'm a tall guy i got big hands you know uh, i'm walking around here looking like a basketball player do you hoop i don't even hoop you know what i mean but you know, show some love to me. I hope that the control is very comfortable with uh, uh, guys with big hands. Shout outs to big handed people in general. Um, let me see. Um, I think that's about all I remember. Um, vibration, more battery life. Uh, oh, the last thing I think, uh, the create button. Eh, you know, mm, 
okay I, I guess sony didn't really go into great detail about that button but i guess it's supposed to be legit it's supposed to be lit you know from what i'm hearing which is that's all i heard is that it's supposed to be lit i hope that it's not just another share button but just a different name you know same game different name you know i hope it's nothing like that uh, the, it's called the creative button so i'm hoping that we can actually really get creative with it hopefully you know it will be the share button and then some you know what i mean like i'm talking like i don't know like you know editing i think i heard about that i think i heard maybe we can be able to edit video I th well you can do that with the share button i, I kind of forgot because i don't play my ps4 no more the only time i'm playing my ps4 is fighting games and exclusives but that's besides the point that's, that's not the topic the topic is the ps5 controller okay um the creative button i'm hoping that you know there's a lot of features with that button to say the least okay moving on um now uh with that being said what said with that being uh, uh, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to just, you know, let you know how I feel about it. I like the controller. I love the controller. I liked it from the moment I seen it uh, look wise. You know, if we're talking looks, aesthetics or, you know, I, I like how it looks. A lot of people I know, you know, the going, you know, I, I've been around the web, you know, world around the web is that, you know, they've been it barely made sense. Pe people don't like the controller is, is what I'm trying to say is my point. They, they don't like it. They don't like the way it looks. They think it's like meh. you know, they're really not feeling it. Uh, too much but um me personally i personally like it i think it's okay you know i don't have a problem with it um i like how it looks i think it has a nice look i like the I, I personally i like i'm into white tech white technology so i like that it's white i wish it was kind of all white but you know it's cool um but i like it i i think it's cool you know a lot of people think it's ugly and you know i've seen a lot of memes and all that other stuff but i think it's legit i mean it looks comfortable it looks cool to me it, i dare i say it I, I might even think it's probably the best looking controller uh that sony might have maybe made or manufactured i don't know because uh, well the dual shock and the other controllers was just kind of like i don't know but i don't know i like how it looks um that, now that d-pad though i don't know about that d-pad i'm a little worried about it not look wise but performance wise like i don't know how that's gonna fare up playing fighting games it don't look like a fighting game pad anymore uh, d-pad it looks more like it kind of looks like i don't know i'll take you guys way back uh it was a ps3 prototype uh it was i think they it was called the boomerang it was the ps3 um uh prototype controller and it, it, the d-pad kind of looks like you know it kind of looks like that d-pad from the ps3 proto prototype controller so and it just doesn't really look like you can really throw down on some fighting games with that you know i'm a little concerned about that you know because i I've always personally liked it, the D-pad of the Sony PlayStation, and it, I don't know, you know, maybe I'm wrong, maybe it's just the way it looks because it's white on white and it's hard for me to tell, but I'm just a little worried about that. So to my to my platformer gamers and to my, my fighting gamers who love that D-pad, and you know, sometimes I always want to use a fight stick, you know, um, I don't know, that D-pad, is it don't look too bouncy or floaty or, you know, it just don't look like you could hot again, you know what I mean? But I don't know, maybe that's just the way it looks in the pictures. But anyways, I like the controller and um, I like how it looks. I think it's going to be lit. You know, I, I can't wait for the PS5. It's, it's, you know, it's going to be lit. And you know, a lot of people, I think, are kind of bashing the console, too. But there's really nothing to bash because, you know, it's not really we don't have any information on it, really, other than, you know, the specs. Well, we don't really know how it look, you know, but um, I like the controller. I think it's cool. Um, a lot of people bashing it. I know I'm in a small. What is it? percentage group crowd whatever but i personally think it's nice um i hope that the playstation is going to be lit uh, i'm favoring the, the 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 s i hate saying that name the new xbox the xbox series x but i mean i'm gonna have both i mean come on i'm gonna kick that kid like <laughs> what the heck do i look like i have the ps4 pro and the xbox one x now like i'm gonna have both consoles but um yeah so i don't know that was just you know my take on the controller you know what i think about it or whatever i said i can't even remember um you guys let me know you know uh leave a comment down below you know let me know what you guys think about it i'm afraid that you guys might be the majority oh it's ugly it's not ugly to me it looks cool like i like it now i don't is it going to be more comfortable than the xbox controller no absolutely not in my opinion not for me personally but i think it looks awesome and i think it's going to be an awesome controller and i think that the ps5 is going to be an awesome console we want it to be we want both of these consoles to be awesome if you're a true gamer at heart you want both of these consoles to thrive uh with that being said you know this has been the kickback kid and um yeah i'm excited i hope you're excited ps5 coming soon let's get it um leave comments all that other stuff hit a like for your boy and um i can't remember all that other stuff but yeah you know what to do 
all right um yeah yee i'm out Thank you.